Hi everybody, it's Hannah here with another video, and I'm going to do a video to help people who has parents, and I'm just going to do an advice video for you guys on when is the best time to give you guys, like, um, to help you guys to, um, give you your kids the talk. And, no, I don't have, um, kids, but I'm going to give you guys advice that what I would do until I have kids to give them a talk or kind of how to, um, when's the best time kind of situation. And I, my, one of my ideas or tips or thoughts on let your kids guide you towards that. And I, that's one of my big tip, like have your kids guide you and tell you or hint at you when they are ready and you're probably wondering what if they're like two years old or, you know, like under five and just like, I don't want to give them too much detail or I don't want to say the wrong thing or what. Well, you could, like, try to tell them kind of like a story, I guess, saying, like, oh, mommy has, like, an egg in her stomach, and it grows and grows and grows, and then it'll hatch once it it's ready to come out of mommy. And that's where babies are born. So it's kind of you're, you're telling them without giving them too much in detail in a wrong way. Instead of saying, oh, mommy and daddy, you know. But so you're kind of telling them in baby steps of what age that they're in. So if they're like under five, that's one way to tell them the talk. Very little people are like nearby around me here. But my car is driving fast, but it's just awkward when there's people like right there. Hello, <laughs> you eagles. Slower. Come on, good. But, but what? In my opinion, once the the 
kids get older, you can, like, give them more in detail, I guess. In a way, or more straightforward. Like, instead of the example that I said, like, oh, mommy has an egg in her, and when it's, once it hatches in her stomach, then all ready to come out, and etc. Instead of that way, you could tell them once they get a little older, older, like once every three or four years, once they, it doesn't have to be in that chunk of time, because... Every kid is different, curious with different things, etc. And they could, I don't know, I don't know what I'm kind of, but after like, after certain years when they ask questions, you can give them more detail or more mature way, like mommy and daddy or mom and I, instead of like, egg is hatching you can say well that is true but there's more help instead of that my daddy helps out to give them a special milk or to put in them or whatever to kind of give them more tense or more details it sucks and more the older that they get you can just say, oh, mommy and I, daddy, or mom and I do this kind of situation. But, yeah. I don't know. But, it, like I said, just have the kids guide you, I guess. And depending on the age, depending on what kind of information you can give them. And there's no right or wrong answer to give them the talk, I guess, or anything like that. It's just what you feel most comfortable and what they can understand, I guess, because you know your kids a little bit better, and once they get older, you'll know their vibe and what they feel comfortable of knowing and what knowing, and it depends on the gender, too, and if you feel more comfortable having your other partner talking about it you know you can and that that's kind of like how I'm gonna I don't know teach my kids or give my kids the talk or whatever I will have them guide me and have them tell me when they're ready etc I guess and do and and I'll be as open as possible and just tell them whatever they feel the most comfortable with. And I'm open talking about practically anything. So, yeah. So I hope this helps you guys. If you have any other questions related to this, feel free to let me know. Please like, please subscribe, and I'll see you next time.